We welcome everybody here at the Under Armour event, the coach of the South team, the coach of the championship McDonough team, undefeated this year, Taylor Cummings. Taylor, congratulations on your success. Thank you, really appreciate it. A lot of pressure taking over that kind of position from a guy, Chris Robinson, who mm -hmm. won so much, who you play for. Mm -hmm. how, how did it go in your first, this is your first full year, right? First full year. It was a really fun year. I was lucky enough to have not only a great group of girls and players, but a great group of parents and a really supportive administration, a lot of the administration that was here my first year was there when I was a student so felt like going back to home right now I did see you at Homewood mm -hmm. it's amazing how much we're at Homewood Wayne uh -huh. all right uh, going nuts when the women won yeah how to make you feel great oh it was awesome my sister was a senior on the team so to see her end her college career on top uh, with the national championship and see the all the work that all these girls do day in day out so to see that work pay uh, rewarded and have them earn a trophy is, is it's awesome. Tell us about your history with the Under Armour game. It was special to you, I know. Yep, I played um, in two of the underclassmen tournaments before um, playing in the senior game. Uh, we were the first South team to win in a few years, so it was fun to fun to be out here. And it's just it's a really cool experience. You meet so many not only of your teammates from different areas, but future rivals, future people that you're going to be playing against for the next four years. And um, there's there's a great sense of excitement for the future at this event. And and I know the talent that's going to come through is going to be incredible. Talk about the kids from your team who are going to Maryland to continue that McDonough Maryland tradition. Yep, we have one McDonough to Maryland player in Emma Shedig. Um, she's on the U.S. U19 team. Um, she's just she's an incredible kid. We'll do great things at Maryland. Really excited to watch her and my other two McDonough kids that are here, uh, Blair Perry and Julia uh, Julia Dorsey, continue their careers. All right, that's great and. Uh, Julia Bragg, you expecting big things from her this year? Do I have the right name? Huffman, Julia Huffman. Huffman. I'm Huffman. sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, this was a very senior-laden team of Maryland the last this past year, so um, there's a lot of openings, a lot of chances for Hoffman and the rest of the incoming class and last year's freshman class to really make a splash. So I think the Terps are going to be young, um, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. At the Jack Lish Law Group, uh, not only will you feel like a member of their family, uh, you'll also receive uh, unprecedented customer service. We love our clients, and you'll see that if you trust us at the Jackler Small Group, the big dogs from the small firm, and we'll reward your trust. Call the big dogs today. Don't wait. Find us online at bigdogsmallfirm.com. Right, last question. As a winner of three tour ton awards, which is almost unbelievable, <laughs> How'd you feel about Megan Taylor? Oh. And, you know, as a goalie and yep. little Megan Taylor, who had such a great year she's, winning the tour time. She's an incredible person. And so just to see it go to like an incredible person like Megan is really is really just it makes me smile. But um, I think she gave a lot of hope to goalies, younger goalies and goalies in the game right now that they can have an impact on their team. That's great enough that they can win something and be the most valuable player um, and the best player in college lacrosse. And um, if there was ever a goalie to win it, this Megan Taylor was it. Her timing was good. And I said break, that Julia break mm -hmm. was just incredible. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely incredible. Great defender. I saw her growth from my fr my senior year, her freshman year, to seeing her being a senior captain. Um, she, she learned a lot. She grew as a player, as a leader. And... Um, she had a great career in College Park. Last question. Are you involved with the professional league? Do you have time? Yes. or uh, What team are you playing for? I play for the fight. And that's from? Uh, it's, so it's just the WPLL fight. There's no more locations anymore. So it's so like the, it's uh, like the PLL. W, uh, PLL. Yeah. And uh, what a success that was last week for the PLL. Yeah, we were at, actually at Homewood. Um, I know PLL sold out their stands. Right. Um, we were fortunate enough to have you know a bunch of local fans come and watch our games as well. So do you get paid? Yes, we do. That's, so. the most important, <laughs> that's the most important thing. Anyway, good luck. Uh, it's an all-star game, Thanks. but you got to get everybody in. But it's, yep. it's still competitive down the end. Yeah, I mean, you and can't And you're take, always competitive. Yeah, you can't take the competitive drive out of these kids. So it's an all-star game, but it's always a good show. You got it. Thanks for Thank coming you. on. Continue success. Thank you.